The Iglesia de Cristo members in eastern Canada are extending their help to the community by conducting a cleanup drive. Here's the report. This year, the locale of Toronto is celebrating its 40th year of establishment in the thriving and diverse city of Toronto. As part of its celebration, the locale has launched a series of community service work to give back to the city that welcomed the Church of Christ as its home here in Canada. Today, members of the locale of Toronto are participating in the annual citywide initiative to clean up Toronto. Led by their minister, Brother Bernard Diwa, members of the Local Congregation of Toronto first gathered in the Toronto House of Worship to organize themselves into smaller groups that will be spread out in the nearby neighborhood around the chapel area. From children to teenagers to parents, even grandparents, everyone is indeed present today to show their unity and appreciation for the city. Members gladly picked up stray garbage and litter and properly disposed and recycled them. They have also brought Pasugo God's Message magazines with them to share their faith with non-members they have seen along the way. This is truly another way of showing their love for their fellow men as well as their neighborhood. After their cleanup, members walk back to the Toronto House of Worship and cap the activity with a socializing and barbecue. The members of the Toronto congregation uh, join hands in uh, cleaning the community to show our respect to the neighbors also and to continually provide not only camaraderie but uh, brotherhood with our local congregation. This is also the start of our evangelical mission and campaign for the International Evangelical Mission, which will be sponsored by the Church of Christ all over the world. My most favorite part was to, to clean up our neighborhood because we get to help people keep, um, and also remind them to, to keep the streets clean and also their sidewalk clean. We got to clean up the neighborhood and pick up some garbage. And we also got to hand out some God's Message magazines to some people. Helping keep the community clean is indeed a wonderful and engaging way of giving back to the city. An activity like the annual Clean Toronto Together can also help in bringing the family and members together in a shared goal of keeping the city cleaner, healthier and safer to live in. This is truly a worthwhile activity for the Iglesia Ni Cristo members, especially the children, to learn how to be more responsible and take care of the environment. The locale of Toronto was not the only one who joined the city in this activity. Here is Monica de Jesus from the locale of Victoria reporting. Spring has finally sprung. It's that time of the year again for the Iglesia de Cristo members of the Toronto community to join in a concerted effort to preserve the city parks and greenery. Neighborhood volunteers and advocates of the clean and green unite in the annual spring cleaning this weekend, April 23 and 24 onward, to keep the city of Toronto green and beautiful. It was fun. I helped my friend Lily and we picked up some garbage. It's truly inspiring seeing families and children become involved in the Clean and Green initiative of the city. This shows a great example of what can transpire when people work together to create a better community. We serve as examples to our kids. Uh, for whatever activities in the church that's being launched, um, we, we take part as a family. More than 100 volunteers from the Church of Christ, locale of Victoria, consisting of the young and old alike, gather together at Edwards Gardens. For Eagle News Service, this is Monica De Sous. This is Camille Enriquez, your Canada Bureau. I am one with 25. 